hello everyone welcome back to my channel i am timmy and this is my channel called timmy banjo if it's your first time here welcome to my channel yeah This is a formal welcome back invite. I posted on my Instagram that I am back for good on this YouTube. So all of you that you, you know, waka go somewhere that I don't know, come back to me, okay? I am fully back on YouTube now. And that is why I am filming this video to tell you guys that I am ready mm, to be consistent this time around. Oh, good news. Anyways, I am done with my master's program now. <laughs> I am a master's holder. Well, not yet. I am formally done with all my modules, like my courses, every single one. I have written all my assessments, all my essays, everything. <gasps> and I am done. I came here last year, January. It's like a, a year and a month now I have been in the UK and I have been enjoying myself in this country. Anyways, I came here last year for my master's program. As you all know, we are, on, we are all on this wave. I'm not going to say what the wave is, but you know what the wave is. We are all on this wave and I, you know, entered the ship and <laughs> found myself here. That is why I came here for my master's program. And my master's program was um project management and operations management which i am so happy and i'm so thankful i chose that course because it is sought after it is a course that no matter what you do once you want to do anything concerning project management you have to do like a certification but look here i did the whole thing i did the whole master's program i am the most sought after <laughs> Amen to that. Anyways, so I did MSc Project Management and Operations Management, which are two different, um, what's it called? Two different things. Operations is one, Project Management is another, and I did both of them. So that's just a cue for any one of you that is um, planning to come here to, you know, do your master's program. Please choose a course that is very, very good something like digital marketing, something in IT, something in business analytics, all those type of things, they are jobs or they are courses that will definitely get you a good job. You know, you know, have to start rambling around for jobs because honey, getting a job here is hard, but it's possible, but it's really hard because they also have to do like their checks properly and make sure they are hiring a person that is good for that role number one number two they always speak experience over certification here so the moment you get here try and gain some you know experience in the uk it's very important at least over six months experience in the field you are planning to go into is important so aside the fact that you are choosing a good course for your masters you need to gain experience that being said back to myself i am done with my master's program now i'm moving forward um i'm still staying back here this is my new house i'm not going back to nigeria <laughs> i'm staying i'm staying in the uk i'm not going back <laughs> oh yeah i'll come and greet you people so i'm staying back here i'm going to continue working here i'm still you know trying to look for like a better job but i'm still working now in the healthcare sector which i you know find very interesting because obviously with my program Mm, like I said earlier, you can work anywhere. So there are project management roles in the NHS, in banks, everywhere. As long as there's a project, as long as there's operations there, I'm your guy, okay? So I'm gaining experience and, you know, trying to look for a better job to up my money and up my funds. That being said, if you have any job for me, if you have any referral for me, please do not hesitate. A good turn deserves a roundabout, okay? do that good turn to me i will round it to your kinsman all right if you know how you can reach me my email will be down send me an email i'm looking for a job anyways i'm so thankful to god for this journey so far uh aside advising you people on how to go about your master's program which is full i mean 
there are so many videos everywhere about how to go about your master's program how to you know apply to schools on this same internet so i don't think i want to delve into that i just want to tell you how life will be or how my life was when i was in my master's program when i came in i i studied in university of huddersfield uh, the school fees, I think I mentioned how much the school fees was. I'm going to leave the video up here. I I think I mentioned everything, how I came up with the, the bill, everything. I'll leave that video up here in the card. So make sure you check that out if you want to know anything about, you know, funding. It's quite okay, but it keeps increasing every year. I paid 12. I think this year was like 15. Next year will be like 16. It keeps going up. So the longer you wait, the more expensive it will be. I'm not saying you should, you know, uh, rush yourself or do things that you're not meant to do to get money. But I'm just saying the earlier, the better. Then I got here, you know, got my apartment. Thanks to my parents, thanks to my family members. I mean, they are my rock. I wouldn't have done anything without them. <laughs> got here i got a job which i wasn't happy with i moved over here when i tell you jobs are more than people here there are jobs here once you get in start looking for a job although the process is a little bit you know so you have to take your time and make sure that you um, you have all the papers they are asking you for your references they are so important your references are important all those things make sure you have everything they're asking you for get a job as soon as you get here start looking for a job you need that experience no matter what job it is when i tell you no matter what job it is because all of us are all collecting the same nine pound fifty per hour the highest you get is probably if you work in an agency and you're getting like 13 14 or 12 pound per hour but i'm just saying no matter what it is you'll be okay you'll be all right trust me get a job aside from the fact that you are saving money or you are using it for your upkeep you need that experience and if you can volunteer too you can also volunteer it helps to when you put that on your cv all those things go a long way so i got a job i wasn't happy with it i moved to another job which i have been doing so far that job took all of my time because during the summer i was working full time i did not have any time for anything and you know once you start collecting pounds inside your account and you're looking at it to be sweating you <laughs> so i abandoned youtube but now <laughs> i am humbly back because it was difficult for me to <clears throat> combine school and work and then youtube so now i am you know back now i successfully finished all my models my project everything is done i just finished the last one i think last week my last model was just last week so right now i am free as a bird i am free as a bird i am done finally finally i'm just hoping that the grade that i have worked for and i'm hoping and praying for you know comes out the way it is mm? because i really did all my work myself I try my best to do, you know, once I have an assessment, I make sure nothing clashes with it. I, you know, close out everything else and focus on my assessment. So I really put all my energy into my work, my school work, right? Because that's obviously my priority. Then again, you know, perspective of staying back here, I'm not going to start mentioning the ways you can, you know, stay back or you can, you can relocate here. Is that you get a skilled worker visa? Is it that you get the care worker visa? I think it's the same thing. You get married or... I think that's it. So either of those ones, those are the prospective way. Or you do the post-study visa, which is two years after after your master's program so those are the ways you can stay back and from there you can you know find a way to get a job that will make you stay back in the country sponsor your visa etc etc and so on and so forth so hopefully when i am still on this um, channel i will come back here and give a testimony that i have found a good job okay i am still here rambling searching applying every single day of my life to companies even if it's a graduate internship because obviously i'm a graduate graduate internship just for me to gain experience before i can move on to a bigger position i'll do it anyways that is what i have come to tell you guys that i am done i am finally done with my master's i still remember 
my relocation vlog oh my goodness anytime i watch that vlog i'll pin that up here also in the card anytime i watch that vlog i become so emotional i just oh everybody was in my house that day and so uh, mm, oh i miss everybody but i'm a big girl <laughs> i am a big girl now i have to you know fight for my future I still remember how I came here. I was so confused. There are so many things I did back then last year. And I'm looking back that like, is it me that did all this? <laughs> Don't worry, when you come, you two you will understand. You you will see what I'm saying. <laughs> thank you. Help me thank Jesus. Help me thank God. I give all the glory to God. It is only God that made this possible. And I think that's it for this video. Anyways, your girl is finished. I am a degree hotter. Mm? MSc project management and operations management. So I can do operations, I can do projects. And don't even try me. I know how to use all those project management tools. Anyways, we've come to the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Remember to give this video a thumbs up. And all, all you, you people, eh, all your friends that used to watch my videos that have gone somewhere else, tell them that I'm back. I need you guys back here. We need to continue this journey together of me becoming a billionaire, okay? Me and you together will make it. Anyways, I'm rambling now. I will see you in my next one. It's probably going to be a vlog. And until then, stay blessed and stay safe. And happy 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 new year i'll say happy new year before but i'll see you guys in the next one bye